Would you enjoy a job that requires practical skills? Have you both technical and mechanical ability? Can you focus for extended periods of time? Are you able to do repetitive work? If you said yes to these questions, the occupation of warping machine operator might be the one for you. Fabric is made up of yarns which are woven together. To prepare yarns for weaving, it goes through various processes. Warping machine operators tend to the machinery that does this. The first part of the preparation process involves winding packages of yarn onto large metal spindles called bobbins. Once the bobbins are full of wound yarn, they're placed on a large metal frame known as a creel. All the yarn threads on the bobbins are attached to a warp beam, which looks like a long roller. The yarns are simultaneously wound onto the warp beam to ready it for knitting and weaving. The warping machine operators thread strands of yarn from the bobbins mounted on the creel through drop wires, tensioners, measuring and spreading devices and fastens it to an empty warp beam. They tape the yarn ends to the beam or tie clusters of yarn ends into knots and insert these knots into the slots on the beam. They configure the yarn meter and start the warping machine. The machine operator monitors the transfer of the yarns onto the warp beam. They check that none of the individual yarns twist, break or become tangled with the others. If this happens, the operator straightens the twists, removes the tangles and ties the broken yarn ends together. The machine is stopped when a specified length of yarn has been wound onto the beam. The operator cuts the threads and places gummed tape over the ends of the yarn to stop it unravelling. The machine operator removes the full beam with a chain and hoist and fits a new empty beam to the warping machine. The machine operator keeps records and logs of information such as yarn style number, the number of yarn breaks, machine stops and the amount of yarn beamed. If there are equipment malfunctions, the machine operator notifies the floor supervisor or mechanics who will repair it. Warping machine operators are based in a factory environment, which can be noisy when the machines are running. Protective earplugs and clothing may have to be worn. The work can be physically demanding as operators spend a significant portion of the day on their feet. The employer sets entry requirements for this occupation. Experience as a general worker in a textile factory is advantageous. On-the-job training is given by more experienced workers and operators may be sent on short courses. Warping machine operators may also train as weaving or knitting machine operators as well. With experience, these machine operators may progress to supervisory positions. An experienced operator may, after receiving the necessary training, also be able to progress into a related area, such as quality control or machine maintenance. Some workers may decide to move into other sectors such as clothing manufacturing.